Hi everyone. Welcome to Gardening Coast to Coast. Today's video is about sprawling cucumbers, trellising cucumbers. You can do either. And this is a great example of just letting your cucumbers grow in a long row. And if you have the space, this is something you can do. You don't need to trellis them. You can put them in the ground a foot apart, two feet apart, depending on the variety, and let them go. And there are just beautiful cucumbers There's right in here. There's tons of them in here. It's crazy. I've primarily grown uh, I primarily grown cucumbers on a trellis, so it's really fun for me to see these just sprawling out. And this is really what, you know, how nature intended it. And because we don't have a lot of space, a lot of times we trellis them, but this works beautifully as well. There's probably 20 cucumbers in a two foot row here. Yep, and we can it's keep going down. And this is all you do is you would drop them in. And now you might want to do half of a row this long, wait a couple of weeks, put in more cucumbers because you don't want to get 200 cucumbers at the same time. And you just drop seeds in, you can drop transplants in. Succession plant. And you don't have to be fancy. A lot of people get concerned that they have to prune, they have to trellis, they have to do everything perfectly, but you can just plant and let them go. Here, you just, here they just have soil here around the plants themselves. Probably drop some fertilizer in, and in between the rows, there's just wood chip mulch. Okay, let's go over to trellis cucumbers. And that's a great way to save space because most of us don't have all of this space for growing beautiful cucumbers just like this. Here is a great example of some cucumbers that are trellis growing up to save space. And I love this trellis. It's super simple. You don't have to spend a lot of money on a trellis. All this is is a T-post, a PVC connector, a metal pole kind of fed through to the other end and then deer netting. And the cucumbers are just kind of woven up here through this netting as they grow up. It gives a lot of airflow to the plants. And there are a ton of cucumbers underneath here. I'm gonna show you guys real quick. Look at this amazing cucumber. It's growing beautifully. And cucumbers don't really need any support off a trellis. So just find a trellis that works for you. Don't spend a lot of money, keep it really simple. There's a ton more growing down there, right Gary? Yeah, so this was harvested. All these vines were harvested recently. You just come across this way and as you find the vines, you help them along, just gently tuck them into the space. If you put in a bigger leaf and kind of move it, that kind of secures it there. But cucumbers grow quickly. So these little tendrils will grab onto the netting, the plant will grow upward. And you can see some of those smaller cucumbers are coming in. One right here, another one down there. There's one right in there too. So there's a lot of cucumbers left and they're still flowering. And this is great, again, if you don't have a lot of space, which most of us don't, these are planted two plants, one or two plants, every 16 or 18 inches, and that's filling up this whole trellis. It's maybe six to eight feet long. Let's go over to another example for trellising cucumbers. So here's another example of trellising, and it's primarily a trellis to take the cucumbers upwards. But you can also let them sprawl out if you have space. You can let the vines, you know, come out of the raised bed into your path, or you just pick it up, tuck it in to the cattle panel. And as this trellis is upwards, I will begin to prune out some of the leaves on the bottom, build that airflow. But you always want to prune slowly and give the cucumber time to grow vertically. There's so many different ways to trellis. This is a great way to do it. This cattle panel is just arched over two raised beds. Very simple, very inexpensive. And then you just weave the plants up the trellis as it grows. You can even use a simple stake. You can use some galvanized metal fencing. And here's a great little A-frame trellis right behind it here. So those are two different ways you can grow cucumbers. Either sprawl out if you have the space available or trellis it to save space, get better airflow. Either way you do it, you're gonna grow a lot of cucumbers. Thanks so much for watching the Gardening Coast to Coast series. We'll have a podcast coming soon, so make sure you check the link in the video description. Let us know how you like to grow cucumbers, and we look forward to seeing you on the next video. Thanks for watching. And give the cucumber time to grow vertically. There's so many different ways you can trellis. We should, we, let's try it over again. Okay. Sorry. Three, two, one, action. Okay, three, two, one, action, sorry. Three, two, one, action. There's so many different ways to trellis. This is a great to get better airflow. Either way you do it, you're gonna grow a lot of cucumbers. Oh yeah, closing. Um, <laughs>